Hi everyone, it's Rebecca from Nizra, and today we're going to be making some elephant toothpaste. Once you've gathered all your supplies, we're going to go ahead and start with our plastic bottle and we're going to add a few squirts of dish soap into the bottle. After you've added your soap into your bottle, next up you are going to put four ounces of um, Salon Care peroxide. So this is the same peroxide that they use in salons. Um, so ask an adult for help with this one. Again, four ounces, and we're gonna go ahead and just add that um, into our bottle as well. All right, so I did add in my peroxide, and I'm just mixing with the soap a little bit. Next, we're gonna measure out four ounces of fairly warm water, and we're gonna empty our entire yeast packet into the water and we're going to stir it around um, until it is all dissolved. Um, you want to use pretty warm water so that it does dissolve into the mixture. Um, I just used sink temperature warm water so we'll see how it goes. It looks like it's dissolving well so I'm just going to keep stirring it um, until it is all combined. For the last step we are going to go ahead and add the yeast into our bottle. I did go ahead and put safety goggles on um, just in case the recipe does call to use a two liter bottle and I did not have one so uh, I use the same ingredients for my small one so we'll see you know how big it does get. Um, so very carefully I'm going to go ahead and pour this in. You can see it's already coming up. I think it looks like toothpaste. Again, be very careful. You don't want to touch the foam um, with it being used, um, you know, salon grade peroxide. Um, it could burn. So if you do have gloves, you should throw those on as well. I hope you guys enjoyed the experiment today.